Our mission is to bring uh, access to capital in underserved areas of the country, in particular the Appalachian Regional Commission. And what we focus on is organizing successful, wealthy business people uh, to create high-performing angel groups in their, in their region or in their community so they can invest in companies in their backyard. We uh, have a power grant to organize a minimum of four angel capital groups in the region. We are actually in the process of forming one of those right now. And then the second component of that is to form an alliance of angel capital groups that we've already formed in the region, plus others that are operating in the region so that they can better scale their projects and leverage their resources and uh, share best practices. We uh, recently closed on a deal that uh, it was a it was a follow-on funding. It was a, a deal in, uh, out of Knoxville, uh, and they were able to uh, uh, get capitalized initially by our angel capital groups with about uh, $4 million of capital. Uh, and then they recently were able to attract a large investor for $12 million of capital. So that gives you an idea how once you start something locally and get it seated that you can attract significant capital if it's a good deal. What we're looking at doing and really the idea of our of our power grant is to connect these different groups together. So I think of it like a community banking system. So you have to have the, you have these different equity banks almost in these different uh, communities. And the grant allows us to bring those all together so they can scale and share things. And I think without it, it would be really difficult to do that. They'd be kind of independent operators. So this enhances the ability to support each other and scale local projects when you need to.